Hello, my beautiful angels, and welcome back to my channel for today's look. We are doing this stunning makeup look on Titi Melly. This is a recreation of Arani Hussain's, I believe that's how you pronounce uh, the makeup artist, of that look that they created. It's absolutely stunning. If you want to go see it, it was on um, ABH's page. Go check it out because they did an amazing job and we decided to recreate it because it is gorgeous. I know it is. Right? I think mm -hmm. it looks so good. It's and so, so fun. I know. Right? I love the colors together. It's really fun. It's not something that you would normally, I mean, blues and purples, yeah, but it's not something normally the the way that it is that you would put together. And it's like, it's fun, but it's also smoky and I sultry and sexy. And you can make it even smokier by putting black in the oh, waterline yeah. too. So. It looks really good. Is yeah. It? Top notch. Thanks, thanks, you know. You know. Well, I have a beautiful model, so it helps when you have well, a gorgeous I mean, model. <laughs> I mean, let's be real and call it what it is, you know? <laughs> it's just because of her, let's be honest, okay? <laughs> so we're about to dive into this video, but before we do, don't forget to subscribe, hit that notification bell so you know exactly when my next video comes up, and like this video if you want to see more of the fabulous Titi Melly in here. And if you're ready, grab your brushes and let's go. Say hi to Mila, guys. Look, Mila, look at the camera. Isn't she so cute? What kind of dog is she again, Titi? She is Chihuahua Shih Tzu Mix. Isn't she cute, guys? She's a rescue. That's we, my baby. We love little Mila. Say yeah, bye-bye, Mila. She's like, eh. <sighs> whatever. All right, so we're gonna be recreating this look by Arani Hossein. If I butchered your name, I am so sorry. We I tried that like 12 times before we, we did this, so I just want you to know. We did. So, but we're going to be recreating this stunning look, and we already have Titi's bros dead. Look at them. She fleeky. All right. So, we're going to be starting with my P. Louise base in the shade 02. I have some on the back of my hand already because I cut her brows with this, and we're going to put this all over her lids. All right. So, now that we have... <laughs> Sorry. I'm laughing at Titi's bun. Show them the bun. I mean, See? what's wrong with my bun? Look at our bun. Look buns. at yours. Listen, we tried to do that whole cute messy bun. It don't work with curly hair, okay? Nice. It, it works on my hair. I know what you're talking about. I look cute. Have you seen your bun right now, girl? Do we need to turn it? Excuse me. <laughs> All right. Okay, so we've primed Titi's lids with the P. Louise base, and now we're gonna go in with the Silk Cream Shade. There is some in there, it's on the rim. You just scrape, just work a little bit. And we're going to put that in her crease, because even though the crease shade is that pink color, I want there to be a base of, of a more neutral skin tone color there first, so it makes it easier to blend. My God, that P. Louise base does wonders. Look at that. Look at your crease. This eye? No, this eye. See how you can see it? No. This eye? I'm sorry, it was this eye. Okay, yeah, yeah. You see, that's what I was looking at first. You were like, no. I'm like, well, but she was touching this eye. My bad. So. <laughs> it's been a day, okay? Mm. Yeah, I see it. Right? <laughs> we have a special guest. This is Mila. My baby. She's so cute. She's so sweet and she's so tiny and she doesn't get any bigger than this. Tell people to stop calling your name. That's deal. Fine, you can answer him. We'll be back. <laughs> Alright, so now that we have her transition on, we're gonna go in with my Natasha Denona Mini Lila palette and we're gonna go in with this shade, which is Poison Berry. And we're gonna start putting that in the crease. Where are you going? See that? Always tap the brush off. <laughs> Not laugh under these circumstances, okay? That's Miyagi freaking out. That's her other dog. He's a pug. Hmm. I'm gonna finish blending this crease and we'll be right back. All right, now that we have Titi's crease done with the purples and it's beautifully blended, we're gonna go in with the black shade from the Jaclyn Hill palette and this little JH40 brush. And we're gonna start to put that in her crease really low and make sure that it's seamlessly blended with the purple. Yes. Just look at that real quick. Look how pretty that looks with the black. Isn't that bomb? I'm excited. I know. 
You want to keep this as low as possible because if not, you're going to overtake the purple and it's just going to come become a hot mess. And we don't like a hot mess. Right, Tiffany? Mm-mm. Mm-mm. I can't be looking a hot mess. Not Even though. though my hair looks a hot mess. I look like I have a mullet from the side. Nuh-uh. Look. No, it just looks like your hair is all pushed out this See? way. <laughs> my mullet. <laughs> she got a mini mullet going on, okay? I'm gonna save that front piece with a, actually I'm gonna do that now. Okay, I'm gonna take this small pencil brush. This is the JH39 and I'm gonna take the black again and I'm gonna go in tighter to the inner part of her eye with this. That way it doesn't go too high up. Tips and tricks, people. <laughs> and then once you're happy with the color, we will blend and then we will continue to deposit more as we need to. All right, so I took the liberty of adding some of the black in the outer corner, just like in the picture here. And now I'm gonna cut her crease and then we're gonna add the um, magenta or the purple, which we're gonna use this Stila Vivid Amethyst Metallic eyeshadow. And then we're gonna add some of the poison berry on top with a little bit of spackle. So we finna be right back. Let us one sec. All right, so we cut the, these crease and now we're gonna take this purple shade from the Jaclyn Hill palette and we're gonna put that right next to the black that we just put in our outer corner. <laughs> Why are you looking like that, bro? My uncle's behind the camera. Why don't you come in front of the camera? Say hello hey, to the people. Hello. Why not? Baby, so what? Nice. You fine. You beautiful. No, you know what? I don't you need nobody seeing what I got at home. You beautiful. That's it. Keep me in secret. I don't need nobody seeing what I got at home. That's right, people. Don't be looking Family. at my uncle. Family to be known with all the goodness. That's right. Over here so is true. White chocolate. Right. <laughs> oh, white chocolate. Chocolate. Sexual chocolate. What it do? <laughs> you know, back to the makeup. <laughs> We're just adding this right here as a base before we put down the. Um, Stila metallic liquid shadow. Excuse me, sir. I'm gonna need you to not make so much noise in the kitchen. Thank you. Yeah, seriously. My bad. I'm sorry that I'm in my house. You're welcome. I forgive you. I mean, like, just so this. We got a whole production up in here. We got lights and cameras and all kinds of stuff in here where they're smacking in the back. I know, right? So Do you rude. hear that? The beast in his natural habitat. <laughs> <laughs> see the beast as he watches us. I'm gonna unfollow you, you're gonna have 39 followers. <laughs> Your mama. A nice unround number. <laughs> All right, so now, as you can see, Titi has the purple next to the black, and we're gonna take the Stila Shimmer and Glow Liquid Shadow in the shade Vivid Amethyst. I'm gonna put some on the back of my hand and put it right on top. Look at this. Isn't it beautiful? So pretty. I'm just gonna take a flat shader brush and pat this on top. Oh my God. When you pat it on top, you expose more of the glitter. Oh, that's so beautiful. Oh my God. I feel like I'm watching an episode of Bob Ross. <laughs> <laughs> Just make some pretty birds. Some pretty birds right here. Flying over the mountain. <laughs> Apparently we're the makeup Bob Ross. I didn't say it, my uncle did. <laughs> <laughs> Do you even know who Bob Ross is? I've heard of him. I heard about his trees. Oh God, babe, you just aged us like a mug. <laughs> it's all right, we won't put it on right now. I cannot believe this. All right, look at this. Oh, Show the people. The look how gorgeous this is. You can see the shift between the purple and the glitter that's in it. And so now to make it even more sparkly, we're going to add the Stila Glitter and Glow Liquid Shadow in the shade Ballet Baby. You can't watch it until 2021. Oh, well, that sucks. We're talking about Mary Poppins. If you haven't seen the new one, it's a good one. 2021? That's disrespectful. Yeah, they said because of existing agreements. Oh. On Disney Plus. Well, I'm sure it'll be available like on Amazon Prime or something. To write. We're totally not plugging. If you want to endorse us, Amazon Prime, we'll take the endorsement. Yo, boom. Amazon Prime is here every day delivering packages in my house. I swear. See? Hook it up. All right, so this is what the <laughs> glitter looks like that we're going to add on top. I'm just going to take that same brush and lightly pat 
on top. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Yes, God. <sighs> Glory. Okay, so let's not watch that. Tell your story. <sighs> that is so pretty. It gives like the most. Excuse me. Thank you, Miyahi. Miyahi. He's not leaving me alone. Miyahi. Miyahi. Remember we used to call him? Aweli used to call him Miyahi. Miyahi. Because she couldn't say Miyahi. Mm, that's a lot. Oh, <laughs> uh, here we go. All right. So we just added the ballet baby color on top. And as you can see, it just gives it a nice little subtle extra little um to the purple. Okay. So for the inner portion of the lid, we're gonna go in with this shade right here. This is the Blue Dahlia shade from the Natasha Denona Mini Lila palette. And we're gonna put that on the rest of the eye where the P. Louise base is. All right, so we put the Blue Dahlia shade on top and it looks really good, but because the picture is a little bit more of a Aqua? Yeah, tealish kind of aqua-ish blue-ish. <laughs> I'm gonna mix this teal shade and this blue shade together. Why you look at me like that? Tealish, blueish, aquaish, ish. This ish color. So I'm gonna mix this shade and this shade together to help balance out and get a little bit more teal in this and Yes. <laughs> oh, you're gonna have a fun time editing this video. I'm keeping all this stuff in, bro. With me. Yes. <laughs> oh. oh yeah, that's really pretty. Look at that. I gotta show you. I don't think you can see it. Look at this. Oh, yeah. Right? Oh, yeah. Yes. Jesus is amazing. Thank you. Did a good job. Thank you. It's Jesus. Now I'm gonna spritz it so we get a little extra oomph. Um, this is like where the mist go. All over my tree. I'm trying to help your tree last. Mm. <laughs> Come keep it in place. Mm hmm, mm hmm, mm hmm. Oh, yeah. Way more of a punch here, people. Look at that. Do you see the difference in the eyeballs? See it? I do. You do? I do. Good. All right, so now that we have the top portion of her eyes pretty much done, I'm gonna go ahead and do her face makeup off camera to save some time and we will be right back. All right, so we have Titi's face makeup done. We're gonna go back to the eyes and I'm gonna highlight her brow bone with this Maybelline Master Chrome highlighter in the shade molten rose gold and then on top of that i'm gonna add this gold shade from the natasha denona palette just so that it's not too pinky but it gives oh enough dude so i haven't used this highlight but i recommended it to her because i heard so many good things and i know she loves rose gold so i got her the rose gold highlight and look at that look at your brow bone shift girl that was amazing see that? Look at that. that is oh, so oh, pretty oh. Oh. And then I'm just gonna add a little bit of gold on top to make it a little extra. And then I like to take just a clean blending brush just to make sure everything is seamless. All right, so now we're gonna do the liner on top for the photo and there you go. It's just, it's not a wing liner. It's just going across the lid. So that's exactly what we're gonna do. And we're gonna blend it into the black that is already there. So I'm gonna take my Maybelline Eye Studio Gel Liner and a little- Are you done working out? Hmm? Sorry. No, you're good. No. There you go. This is real life, people, okay? <laughs> life continues to happen around us. Even while we do our makeup. <laughs> So I'm gonna take the Maybelline Eye Studio Gel Liner in Black is Black and a little tart brush, and we're going to line her eyeballs. 
las cosas. Now we're just going to take the pencil brush we used to put the black on and we're going to smudge out this liner so that it blends seamlessly into the black. I didn't want to do too harsh of a line like it was in the photo. It's beautiful in the photo, but because we're not putting any lashes on her, unless you have lashes. No, no. I did not. Okay, so because Man, we're not... We, prop we did not plan for this. I, I know. I have lashes. lashes. No, it's okay. I'm not you sure? Them. I don't care. Girl. Well, then I'm not using lashes either. So... No, you can use lashes. No, girl. It takes an act of Congress to put those things on. I know, on. girl. I know. Those are good when you got... When you mentally when you prepared. When you be all extra, extra. Mm -hmm, it's mm -hmm. a nice that. Not that nice. Yeah, no, no, no. So, I am just doing a thin line just to define her eyes. And you can see the difference that the liner makes versus without the liner. It just gives her more of a... Sultry, definition. yeah, and definition. All right, so now that we have the top liner done, we're gonna go back in with the Abyss shade from the Jaclyn Hill palette, and we're gonna take that all the way in to her eye. We're not gonna put black in the waterline because she wants to keep that brighter, but we are gonna go in all the way at the bottom with the black. We could put purple in your waterline. Oh, we could. You wanna do that? Mila, don't eat the cord. Mila. <clears throat> All right, now on this pencil brush, we're gonna go in with the Poison Berry shade from the Natasha Denona Mini Lila palette, and we're gonna smoke out this black. And we're also gonna connect it to this outer portion of the wing because in the photo, the bottom and the top connected by the purple. Why y'all gonna be fighting under the camera? <laughs> Tell me, see, these dogs. It's like having children mm -hmm. that don't grow up, okay? They don't potty train themselves. You, they don't feed themselves. You know what? They always love you and they don't give you attitude. That's true. Unless they try to bite your finger. Eh, that's neither here nor there. Now with this brush, I'm gonna go in with the original silk cream shade we used in her crease, just to further blend things out. So now she's gonna go put her mascara on. We're using the Lancome Monsieur Big mascara it is the best mascara ever tell them tell them how much you love it i love it it's the bomb.com mm -hmm. i'm gonna do one eye yes two coats one eye top and bottom and it is the bomb <clears throat> we're gonna show you watch yes all right do you see the difference between this eye with the mascara and this eye without that mascara literally you don't need falsies when you have that mascara it is so good look at that that's amazing. I know. I mean, unreal. Yeah. Let me do the other one so I can match. Do it. All right, now that she's got her mascara on, we're gonna go in with the NYX Metallic Eyeliner. This is the rose gold shade. It's really pretty and look up. Sometimes you can see it, sometimes you can't, but it really does make a difference. All right, look at the camera. Do you see the difference in your eyes? It was on this eye. Yes, I see it. Mm-hmm. It's a subtle um, difference and a subtle sparkle, but anything that's lighter is gonna make your eyes look brighter and bigger, which is what we want. Yeah, you can see it. I mean, you can see the difference. Yeah. You see how, how this eye looks a little, a little bit, bit more, more open. open. Yeah, yeah. Mm -hmm. it's true. It gives you that doe-eyed, you know, look when you have um, white or a, a cream in your waterline. Just a little shum shum. There we go. Mm -hmm. All right. For the inner corner, I'm gonna take a mixture again of the two shades that we used for her brow bone. We're gonna do the rose gold highlight and then the gold from the Natasha Denona. And we're gonna slap that in the inner corner. I like to take it up just a little bit so that it blends with everything else. Tell me, gotta do this with my mom. You gotta do her makeup. <gasps> yes, that would be so fun. Let's 
I take it up just a little bit, that way it blends with everything. And now we're gonna take a little bit of the gold. For further poppage. What do you think? Woo! Oh my gosh. That looks amazing. All right, for the lips, we're gonna go in with the Morphe Love Bite Lip Liner. This is literally an amazing lip liner. It is so soft and creamy, and it is so easy to work with. If you mess up or you feel like uh, you need to make something a little bit wider or deeper or um, fix it, you literally can just take your finger and wipe it and it gets fixed. I'm also gonna fill her lips in slightly with this color so that when we put the lipstick on, it blends a little bit easier. For lipstick, we're gonna go in with the Morphe uh, lipstick in the shade Creme. It's just a really pretty nude. And I'm gonna put this on her bottom lip. It's really creamy. All right, blend. And then also on the top a little bit. All right, now that her lip combo is together, I'm gonna add a little bit of this Revlon lip gloss in the shade Fuchsia Finery, just to tie in the eyes. And I'm gonna put this at the center of her lips. Blend. Just to add a little bit more pink. Oh, looks good. Right? Yes. I think it's a little bit more on this side. All right, guys, so this is the finished product. I think it looks amazing. Titi, how do you feel? I feel awesome. You did such a good job. Thank you. You really did. Thanks. It was so fun filming with you. I don't think I you. could cre recreate this. I think you could. You think I could? Oh, yeah, girl. I think you look so good, and it makes your eyes pop. Because oh, no. blues and purples with brown eyes just, like, knock them out the park. So we had so much fun filming this, and we hope that you enjoyed this video. And don't forget to subscribe. Give us a thumbs up if yes. you enjoyed this look. Yes, yes, yes. And if you want to see more of the fabulous Titi Melly on the channel, then give us an extra thumbs up. Comment below. Don't forget to share um, with all your friends, your families, your aunties, anybody. <laughs> and remember that you are so your baby beautiful. Your mamas, your dogs, That's your aunties, ball-headed stepsisters, cousin. The cat. What does your dad say? What is it? The... Auntie's bald headed sister. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. <laughs> All them people. Share this. Uh, show them. Recreate it. Tag us so we can see your beautiful recreations. And don't forget that you are so beautiful. You are so loved. And you are made in the image of Christ. Mwah. Bye, guys. Bye.